We're underway on BBC Radio Sheffield. It is a South Yorkshire derby between the Millers and Owls as the ball is flicked on by Matt Derbyshire straight from the kickoff, straight through to Kieran Westwood as the chant ringing around the New York Stadium is Come on, you Reds. The Wednesday fans to our right hand side, 1,200 of them against the shins of Wilson. Dielna has to mop up, gets it clear, only finds Hunt. Cleared his way as far as Hutchinson now. Here's Nuyu. Nuyu toe pokes it forward, looking for Jeremy Elan. Good start from Wednesday. Elan will cut in from the left and try and get this into the box. Slips it back to McGugan. Here is Lewis McGugan. Low pass into Isgro. He controls McGugan once more. It's forced backwards a little bit here, so he goes back to halfway and Dielna. Oh, Dielna yeah. under pressure from Salmon, that's poor from Dielna. Connor Salmon nicks it through. Here's Matt Derbyshire with a real chance for Rotherham. It's Matt Derbyshire in the penalty area, turns away from his man, they should be one. It's a great save right. from Kieran Westwood, as he's done so often this year. Superb comes to from rest, Westwood. Comes to Wednesday's rescue, John Pearson. Yeah, and as you said, Kieran Westwood, how many times has he done that for us this season? Tackle's just gone in there. The referee's let him play go, which I do like. Here's McGugan for Wednesday on the edge of the box, McGugan. Twists and turns, it's McGugan oh! who shoots, it's a terrific save by the goalkeeper, Emmy Martinez on his debut. Wonderful move from McGugan, toe pokes it forward. So Pringle to take it, left-hand side, curled into the penalty area, comes off Atty Nuiu and loops into the goal! Oh, has the referee given a free kick? I think he has. It will be a free kick, it was almost shades of Lee Grant last night as it looped up into the air and Kieran Westwood flapped it into his own goal to Lees, overcast here in Rotherham today and Lees almost lost it there with Smallwood breathing down his neck just get it back to Westwood though, up towards Ati Nuiu it hangs in the wind, Nuiu not the best touch to try and find McGugan but it still falls to Elan anyway McGugan with a wonderful ball, finds Joe Mattock Mattock into the box, good chance for Wednesday across towards Kieran Lee and it's not taken, it's blocked in the six yard box a real chance for Wednesday, Kieran Lee with his head in his hands Pringle raises his right arm, will curl this one into the near post, flick towards oh. goal, saved by Westwood, who punches what it away at the second attempt. That, that was in all the way, I actually thought it was in the net, and he's all of a sudden stuck his arm out. Keelan Lavery taking his tracksuit top off is about to come on, Wednesday get it back from the throw, clear it up towards New U, little dummy there from uh, Morgan to Broadfoot, Tottenham 3, Leicester 2, Harry Kane hat-trick at White Hart Lane, no surprises there. That, that England call-up didn't do Mahodo, was it? Yeah, yeah. It was, uh... <laughs> uh, the ball's chipped into the box. V Vermeil will head this one clear as far as Pringle, who's Goal. used to play to the game. Rather than lead, and it's Ben Pringle again. Well, I wonder if he'll be on Twitter again tonight as Ben Pringle celebrates in front of the Rotherham end. It took a wicked deflection, the wrong foot of Kieran Westwood. And it's the Millers who lead in this South Yorkshire derby. 56 gone, Rotherham 1, Sheffield Wednesday 0. It's halfway, he's eager to get rid of it. Moves it over towards Jeremy Elan. Elan tackled by Hunt, it's too easy. Not been Elan's day so far. Hunt gets it, darts into the middle. Jack Hunt still going, he's taking it an awful long way, still going, what a goal this would oh. be! Oh, just over the bar. What an effort from Jack Hunt, he picked that up midway inside his own half, went from right to left, and almost Rob Scott stuck it in the top corner. 7 9, double 6, double 9, Andy will be taking your calls for praise or grumble. We're a little bit behind here because of the delayed start. A 3 15 start for Rotherham and Sheffield Wednesday, and Rotherham leading 1 0. Lavery from the left hand side, crosses it in, could find Maguire, headed clear by Pringle, the goal scorer. Now here is Lewis McGugan. McGugan with his foot on the ball, finds Vermeil. now Maguire, Maguire down the right-hand side looking for Lewis McGugan by the right corner flag, McGugan's got away from his man, Lewis McGugan for Wednesday, crosses it in, real chance, and it's yes! It is Keelan Lavery who scores four minutes from time, wonderful work from McGugan, and he's picked out Keelan Lavery who equalises and celebrates with the Wednesday end. The South Yorkshire derby takes a twist, and it looks like it's going to be a one-all draw. Rotherham one, Wednesday one. The quality we were talking about at half-time. McGugan's shown that. He's picked Lavery out. He's beaten his man on the touchline. Picked Lavery out, and it's a simple diving header for Lavery. Because of the great work from McGugan, he picked out Lavery. And at the other end, here's Jordan Barry. Barry coming forward with a chance maybe to win it for Rotherham. Is Barry right. scored? Seconds after Wednesday equalised. Jordan Barry has won it for Rotherham. Steve Evans is on the pitch. Wednesday so careless at the back, but the Rotherham fans won't care. Jordan Barry scores, and it is.
Chris Rotherham 2, Wednesday 1. Back in the penalty area to defend this corner. McGugan crosses it. Martinez, the former Wednesday man, punches clear. McGugan again will get another chance to cross here. Tries to take on the man on the far side. Hunt does get his crossing. It's deflected though. And then Milson will head clear. And Wilson will try and break. And oh my a word! More challenge from Hunt, who's going to go in the book here for that challenge on the far side on McGugan. So a free kick, John, and a chance to get it into the box again. Yeah, I'm sure McGugan's going to take this. It's out a little bit wider, probably similar to the Blackpool uh, goal that he got. I knew he was in there, and just behind him is Tom Lees and Claude Dielna. McGugan's crosses oh. it. Yes! Equaliser it, Ati Nuiu in service time for Wednesday. What an end to this game as Rotherham United take the lead with three minutes to go. But Sheffield Wednesday will not give in. And Ati Nuiu has equalised with minutes to spare in stoppage time. And it is Rotherham United 2, Sheffield Wednesday 2. Two minutes oh. to go then, just less than that perhaps as Maguire gets it from the throw-in from Vermeil. Maguire gets his cross in well. a Wednesday corner. Well, we've seen three late goals. Let's go for it. Two for Wednesday, one for Rotherham. Is there still time for a winning goal here? McGugan will put the ball on the spot. You've got to give Wednesday credit for coming back after conceding that second goal so late to equalise and now potentially win it. McGugan's cross is... Oh, my word! And it struck the Wednesday man. It's oh. going to be saved by Martinez and somehow that? That kept running. out. That was Stevie May. It's off the line. Stevie May can't believe it. Unbelievable here at the New York Stadium. How on earth has that stayed out, Rob? Twice. Absolutely no idea. That's not gone in the back of the net. Expect from your defence. Well, look towards Barry and Martinez. Well, rather than so close to winning this game and then so close to losing it. And after all of that, it looks like it's going to end up in a two-all draw. We've had the seven minutes on my watch. The referee will allow play to continue for a few seconds more. Headed up towards New Yu. New Yu's in there. Stevie May back heel to Kieran Lee. Oh. Yes! Lee wins it with the last kick of the game for Wednesday. It's unbelievable here at the New York Stadium. Wednesday scored twice in stoppage time and they have won the South Yorkshire derby. Rotherham 2, Wednesday 3. You will never see a finish like this again. Well, what celebrations we've seen down in front of us and the Wednesday supporters, the Wednesday team and the Wednesday staff are thoroughly enjoying this. It has got to be the last kick of the game and Wednesday have stolen it, Rob Scott. Well, I think poor game management, massive... I mean... You're at the end of injury time. You've been winning 2-1. It goes to 2-2. Take your point. Play the game out. Uh, they've not done it, brother. You know, just stick it in the corner. And here's a chance for four. Stevie May. Stevie May runs through. This will finish it. Stevie May for Wednesday to finish. Oh. Martinez with the save. Well, this is ridiculous. Uh, the game goes on. The referee has added eight and a half minutes of stoppage time. He's enjoying now. it. Pringle yeah. for Rotherham trying to muster some kind of comeback, but is it next goal wins? Is it, is the body it? language just seems like Rotherham accept that they've thrown this one away, but you have to give That's credit it. to there Wednesday, who have won the South Yorkshire derby against all of the odds. Keelan Lavery equalised with five minutes to go. You think it's going to finish one apiece. Jordan Barry scores immediately from the kickoff to put Rotherham ahead again. And then two goals in stoppage time from Atty Nuiu and then from Kieran Lee means somehow it is Sheffield Wednesday who take the spoils. John Pearson. Well, I, I am not going to describe that as Wednesday's best performance of the season. I would say it would be in the bottom half of our performances. But the character and the, and the, the way they've, they've kept going to the end, that has been one of the best attributes of this football game this afternoon.